Hey guys, it's Joe Walker here. What the flipping hell is going on? In today's video, we are back at Rock City Skate Park in Hull. We're booked in for an epic four hour session. Here with my buddy Jonathan Cook. The link to his channel is down in the description below. Today, I'm just gonna try and get something new. I've got a couple of ideas of tricks that I wanna land. So just gonna do a nice warm up, kind of feel the park out, get an idea of what I wanna do today and just focus on learning something new. Without further ado, let's get warmed up. Right guys, there we go. All warmed up. Did some work on the box. Did some bank work, did some flat ground, did some mini ramp. Now it's time to learn something new. What I'm gonna try on this little box behind me right there, you guys can see it, this guy. I'm gonna try and learn a backside 50-50. So I've never backside 50-50 before. And I'm just feeling like just vibing today. Not gonna go for anything crazy, but this little box, I can actually, come up onto it, just directly onto that coping, and then hopefully just grind out a backside 50-50. I'm thinking that's gonna work out. Probably gonna take a few tries. Backside grinds are something I've just never, ever done. So hopefully, I'm clutch backside 50-50 today. Let's try it. guys first ever backside 50 50 grind a little bit sketchy but it is literally the first one i have ever done on a skateboard took me about 10 minutes to get that one i'm gonna try and land five today five to keep it alive let's get it guys what a session today that was i was skating hard just practicing stuff that i already know got a really nice juicy kickflip a few nice juicy kickflips not all of them i filmed so i'm happy with that i'm just really focusing on just developing myself as a skater recently and today's session was perfect for doing that i actually uh, wore through 
my shoes. Got the hole of doom, the black hole. Devastated, but those shoes are amazing. I have reviewed those shoes uh, on my channel. I might do another review, like a then and now. So maybe that's something I'll uh, I'll toy with, an idea I'll toy with. Maybe don't really have to do a review because I'm just gonna be completely upfront and honest with you guys. I absolutely love those shoes and I'm gonna buy them again. I'm not even gonna look anywhere else. They are incredible. They've helped me massively uh, learn new tricks. So those shoes are perfect. But this video is not about those shoes. This video is about my epic session. And I learned a new trick. I learned the backside 50-50. Super sketchy. I definitely landed four of them. I wanted five of them. Kind of sort of did a fifth and sixth one, but I don't think both trucks locked in. So I'm definitely counting four of them. Bailed pretty savagely. I uh, actually smashed my back um, and my leg spasmed out, which was not fun at all. So that happened, but I'm okay. Everything's fine. Um, if you're squeamish, look away. Uh, Scott, because I'm going to show you my hand. My hands took a, a real battering today. So I'm going to show you in like three seconds. So just look away if you're squeamish. Three, two, one. Here comes the hand. Yeah, smashed up my hand. That was not good. It was like shaking, <laughs> like uncontrollably for absolutely just hours after. I was just like, oh, my hand. Uh, but yeah, I'm fine. Um, so yeah, epic session. It was good to see Jonathan. Yeah, that guy's a legend. Uh, his progress is like outstanding, really. Like he's learned so many tricks since he started. And yeah, he's, he's keep up, man. You're doing really well. Seriously, it's the, just the development from when I saw him like a month or two ago to now, and the amount of tricks he's learned in that short space of time. He's putting some serious work in. So uh, massive kudos to you, man. That's, that is epic. So, great session today. Really enjoyed it at Rock City Skate Bike. I always do. I always feel like when I've got the time, I've got the dry ground, I've got the perfect surroundings. Obviously, it was quiet there today, which is, is, is excellent. I prefer a quieter park. Uh, I always just perform a lot better uh, when I don't feel like rushed or like I might have like work in the afternoon. It always just helps me with my skating. So, happy with that. I'm seriously happy to have landed a backside 50 50 that I ollied into. That feels really good. That is a massive milestone for me and I'm going to really persist at developing that trick and getting it so it's comfortable. I've had a look around online and a lot of people say that obviously they, they learn the front side 50-50 first but then what they start to find is after persisting with the back side 50-50 uh, they actually find the back side 50-50 easier because you are uh, not coming out sort of on your blind side you're not coming out of the trick like blindsided you are you're looking over the, the, the precipice of the, the ledge that you're on or the rail that you're on. So it, it tends to become a much easier trick. It's just figuring out that first bit. You're like pop and ollie, shift your weight to make sure you lock both of those trucks in and keep your arms nice and open. So you stay locked and you don't start to like slide off the ledge. That's something I was struggling with today, but I clutched a few. I'm really happy with it. Seriously, seriously happy with it. As always guys, I wanna ask you guys, what are you working on? Please do leave it down in the comments below. I really hope you've enjoyed this video. I wanna say a massive thank you for watching it and I'll see you all in the next one. Bye-bye.